Well, over the last couple of weeks, um, I've been privy to uh, some uh, varying pieces of information that have led to these questions today. Uh, it's a concern for me if it's if the uh, what's been conveyed to me and what I've been made aware of and what I've been privy to and documentation that I've seen and indications that I have that these questions need to be asked. I've been encouraged by members of the House of Assembly to ask the questions and to bring it to the Florida House, and I did that today. I've, I've not made any allegations against anybody. I simply asked the questions from the Premier. Where did the information get from Pardon me? Um, I have information that's originated from members of the Liberal Caucus, and I've, I've had a, a variety of, um, I suppose, sources, more than one, but there's different, there's different uh, sources of information that have come to me over the last couple of weeks. You know, I, I want to be very, very careful, and um, because people have a right to raise matter themselves, matters themselves. If people have been subject of uh, any form of harassment uh, by anyone in anywhere in any place, uh, they have a right to decide how they want to deal with that. And I don't want to take away that right, and I've been very, very careful of that. And I don't want to uh, identify anybody, or I, want, I don't want to do any of that. Um, but I've been encouraged to open this conversation publicly, and I've, and I've done that today. And my questions to the Premier were very clear, and his answer was very clear. And I can tell you that the answer he gave today is inconsistent with the information that I've received over the last couple of weeks. So, in speaking with uh, the opposition leader, he says that he's been made aware of that allegations have come forward by members of your caucus, that there was a dispute resolution process that, ha that your staff were involved in. You're shaking your head. No, nothing that I'm aware of at all. I want to make this quite clear that the statements that I've, uh, the allegations that's been made by Mr. Davis today, uh, I take these issues very serious, and there's been no allegations uh, of anything of that nature that's been made to my, brought to my attention, and I think the responsibility on the leader of the opposition is to exactly show leadership if he's aware of anything. Uh, he's made comments about this being directly and indirectly and so on. I think he should follow uh, the lead that I've done in the past with this member of, of his own caucus when I reached out to him in the past uh, to find a solution. So I'm not aware of anything. I want to be very clear about that. But I also want to say this is a very serious issue, it's a very serious claims and allegations that he is making, and I want him to come you know, to me directly and uh, explain to me what it is exactly that he knows.